President Trump and his trade team announcing progress in Chinese trade negotiations with an agreement on a phase one deal. The administration providing a little more detail about that deal this afternoon. One America's Emerald Robinson has those details. The president officially announced Friday morning that he would support the deal in principle that was reached Thursday between the U.S. and China. The president tweeting, quote, we have agreed to a very large phase one deal with China. They've agreed to many structural changes and massive purchases of agricultural product, energy and manufactured goods plus much more. The president saying that the 25% tariffs will remain as is with 7.5% put on much of the remainder. Now the penalty tariffs set for December 15th will not be charged because of the fact that we made the deal. Now the deal in principle comes somewhat unexpectedly as talks between the two countries had once again stalled and with tensions over the president's support of legislation supporting Hong Kong. In a call on Friday with reporters, White House economic advisor Larry Kudlow said that, quote, suffice to say this is a very important step in solving trade relations and imbalances with China. Another senior administration official on the call said that the deal goes into effect almost immediately. However, it will be officially signed in a few weeks at the ministerial level, with U.S. Trade Representative Robert Lighthizer signing the deal for the United States and Vice Premier Liu He for China. The deal comprises multiple chapters addressing a wide range of issues from intellectual property rights, forced technology transfers, financial services and currency reform, along with transparency. And as the president noted on Twitter, the deal postpones tariffs that were set to go in effect on Sunday, but leaves on some tariffs that the U.S. had already imposed. A senior administration official saying that the tariffs are remaining in place as there are a lot of other issues that must be addressed in a phase two deal. Phase two negotiations are set to begin almost immediately. China also held its own briefing announcing the agreement on Friday. However, the Chinese officials during that briefing noted that the agreement still has to go through, quote, legal review, translation, and proofreading. Now, when you're talking about China, the question always is, will they hold up their end of the bargain? That's something that many will be asking in the coming months as this proceeds. At the White House, Emerald Robinson, One America News. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One America News on YouTube and call your cable provider and kindly demand that One America News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.